Namaste and welcome to React Bits. In this series of tutorials where I am reviewing plugins and packages and showing you how to use them, today I have chosen one of the Flutter favorite packages, Flutter Slidable. You can see by the number of likes that this is a quite popular package and the functionality is it provides is quite good and the package is awesome at what it does. So it provides us with a slidable list item where we can provide different options when the user slides. We can provide different buttons, different options and slides can be from left to right or right to left. Okay. So if we see at the features, except primary left, top and secondary right bottom widgets as slide actions can be dismissed, built in action panes, built in slide action widgets. So lots of things are built in so we don't have to do lots of work. We just need to use the functionalities provided by the package itself. So we have a pretty decent example here as well as in the example folder, lots of other example. So I'll quickly create a new demo project to show what it does. Okay. Here I have a very simple project. So I have a material app and home page. In the home page, I have a list of movies that I'm displaying using list view builder and the list tile. So we'll here we'll use flutter slidable instead of this list tile and show some slide actions. So let us get started. First, I have already added the dependency flutter slidable. If you have not, add the dependencies and run flutter pop get and run your flutter project. Now we'll see how we can use flutter slidable. So instead of list style, we should be using slidable. So here, slidable, let's import this. Okay. And we need some things like action pane. So we can use the default action pane. We can customize everything, but default is pretty good. So let's say slidable drawer action pane. Let's use this and then let's use action aspect ratio. Let's use 0.25. So the actions will take the 25% child, let us use okay. and here we'll use a list style and title will be text movies dot index and now we can provide actions. Okay. In the actions, we can provide icon slide action if we want to use icon. So caption, let's give it like icon. Let's use favorite. And let's add another action. Share and let me hot restart. See now when I slide from left to right, we can see the action. We can tap when we tap on the action, it's gone. We can provide some action. So when we tap on the action, what to do? Let's say we tap on this on tap. So for each action, we can provide separate tap functionality and <coughs> if we like, we can also fully customize the icon widget. We can customize the color, background color and foreground color. So let's add background color. Color start white. Let me hot restart. 
see now we have a like button with red background and if we want i sorry actions to show from right to left as well we can add secondary actions i'll just make a copy of these actions as well in the secondary action so that we can see it so now if i swipe from left to right or right to left we have actions and we can provide different actions when we provide from sorry when we swipe from left to right or right to left so this is the basic implementation however there are lot more customizations that we can do so close on the scroll this will make sure that whenever we scroll it will automatically close close the slide action controller we can use controller to initiate the actions from code direction whether or not we want it to be dismissal whether or not it's enabled threshold movement direction so all these things can be customized even the action pane can be customized child can be anything that we like and secondary actions we have different kinds of action widgets as well or we can even use our own action widgets thank you everyone for watching this video i hope you like this video the source code will be provided in the github repository and the link will be available in the description below so don't forget to check it out don't forget to try this package and many other packages and if you want any other packages featured or made tutorial about please let me know in the comments thank you see you again in the next episode